Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this episode of Logic. This video will cover quality and quantity of categorical propositions. The quality of a categorical proposition is either affirmative or negative. Does the proposition affirm or deny class membership? Now, if the proposition affirms membership, then it is said to be affirmative. But if the proposition denies membership, then it is said to be negative. All SRP is an affirmative proposition because it claims that every member of S is a member of P. But no SRP is a negative proposition because it claims that no member of S is a member of P. Some SRP is an affirmative proposition because it claims at least one member of S is a member of P. But some S are not P is a negative proposition because it claims that at least one member of S is not a member of P. Now to help you remember, just remember that a proposition that claims the no or the not is a negative proposition. No or not is negative. All right, pretty simple, right? I think you got that. Let's move on. And we've already talked about quality, which is affirmative or negative. Now let's talk about quantity, which is universal or particular. A universal means everyone, all, the whole the entire group. But a particular, a particular on the other hand means only some, only part, only part of the group, individuals. All S or P is a universal proposition because it claims that every member of S is a member of P. But some S or P is a particular proposition. It claims that only some of S is a member of P. Now, no SRP is a universal proposition because it claims that every member of S is not a member of P. But some S are not P is a particular proposition because it claims that only some member of S is not a member of P. Now, look, these two propositions are universal. And these two propositions are particular. All right, very good. Let's practice what we have learned. Practice problem number one. What is the quality of this proposition? Now, if you need to, press pause, because the answer will appear in three, two, one. Ding! The quality is negative. Next practice problem. What is the quantity of this proposition? Press pause if you need to. Three, two, one. Ding! The quantity is universal. Next practice problem. What is the quality of this proposition? Press pause if you need to. The answer in three, two, one. Ding! The quality is affirmative. Next, what is the quantity? The answer in three, two, one. Ding! Correct. The quantity is particular. Very good. You're well on your way to mastering categorical propositions. Oh, and by the way, for those of you who have made it this far, you've earned your green belt in logic. Comment, like, share, and subscribe, and have a great day.